Hello, hello everyone. I hope everybody's having a great day. It's nice and sunny here. It's about 70. I know some places it's cold. All right. So today I'm going to do some MDF money boards. I like this. They have the little thing and it's good to hang if you do vendor shows and all that. So let's go ahead and take the plastic off the film. They all have it. If you can't, um, if it's hard for you to take it off, you can set it under your press for a little bit and roll the corners. You don't need no tool or anything. It's real simple. And I don't have nails or anything either. So make sure you get it all off. Um, depending on where you live, you might want to um, pre-press or, you know, you can set it under the press like that until um, your press gets to the temperature. You know, let it warm up, get let it get any moisture out and all of that. All right. So we're going to do a few designs. I got um, the elements off of Creative Fabrica and then I put them together. Everything will be in the description on where I got the blank and where um, I got the design. I might not find, um, get all the links to every element that I use because um, I might have got it from different places. So here's one. Like the background might be one place, the bunny another place, the eggs another place. So those are different elements. I put them together and um, made a design. So that's kind of cool. So, with the money boards, they come with their own um, plastic thing. Then you can put it in, you just take the adhesive off, go ahead and stick it, nicely package, and everything. So, let's see, let's see. So, how I usually get my design is, I get my little fancy tool, and I measure from here to here. It's a little bit, six inches or so. And then I measure here to here, a little bit four. All right, and then I put those measurements in my design. I get like a box, put it in, I start designing. But then you gotta make sure you have room for your bleed. So you can add another quarter, so make it like 4.125, unless you need more of a bleed. My bleed is usually not that much, especially on a light design, it's very hard to see. And then um, the same thing for the top, you do 6.125 and um, um, start designing. So here's the back, the front, all right. So, yep, let's go ahead and let's put our design on. Let me get my tape. These are super cool to have for the Easter baskets, stocking stuffers, Halloween, Mother's Day, um, Father's Day graduation, you know, we know baby showers, um, communion. You never know, uh, you know, when you never know what to get somebody, we always give them money. So why not spice it up a little bit? Put it on something. And then, um, give it to them like that so like I said I don't really give myself much bleed so um you might need to make your design a little bit bigger if you want and then what you can do is if you have a light you hold it up make sure it's all on there and I'm going to just put a little tape right here Right there then it doesn't shift make sure it's on there make sure my little my little eggs aren't falling off um, there's always birthdays um, weddings anniversaries there's so many different things you can design and use it for. As you know, we all like to put money in an envelope. Well, now you can. 
It's just gonna be a little bigger envelope. That's all. Then we're gonna knock these out. My heat press is set at 380 for 45 seconds. Um, I don't do anything really at 400. That's up to you. Um, and how um, your paper releases and all that. You got too much light going on, got too much shadowing. All right. I'm gonna just tape it right there. Just be careful when you take the tape off, you don't wanna yank the back. All right, it looks like I, let me move this one a little bit on the top. Okay, we are there, we're there. Oh, I got one more. I'm gonna just tape them all, then um, I'm not gonna press them all at the same time, but we can um, tape them all. And I didn't put prices on it because you never know um, what somebody's um, gonna give and they might change their mind. So you can, um, Leave it blank. You can send it to them to like that, and then they can roll the money and put it in. And this one's like a black design. There we go. We're ready. Make sure you guys hit like, follow, see what I do next. All right, let me get my paper and drop it like it's hot. These are going to be warm when they come out, so make sure you have something to um, grab them with. And then make sure you have something to set something heavy on it, then it doesn't... Um, um, you know, become uneven. Sometimes they do. So I got me some Rego jars over there that I'm gonna set on top, one on each side. Then it can stay completely flat. So this is the first one. So make sure you guys check the description. I'll put all the links in there. All right. Let me get my, I just have my glove, here it is. before I press the next one, make sure. Yes, everything, press it beautiful. Um, yeah, make sure you don't put your tape down too much. So let me put um, something heavy on it. And it can cool down and we'll press the next one. Make sure your heat press is back to the correct temperature before you press the next one. There we go. So I'm kind of doing um, medium to firm. I'm not smushing, smushing it, but I got it's a nice firm pressure. Not too hard, not too heavy. 
Not too easy. And then I'll switch the other one and show you guys. And then that will be it. I have the three. Just a little short video to give you guys ideas for Easter, graduation, Mother's Day, Father's Day, any kind of holiday or celebration somebody's doing. You can give um, a nice gift idea too. So let me put this one over here and it can dry. I mean, put the weight on it, make sure. And then I'll show you this one right here. Beautiful. So let me get this other one on. And I can show you um, how to do it. Or how I do it, I should say. Maybe they might do it different. Okay, make sure your heat press is back to what it needs to be because it might drop in pressure. All right, so I'm going to get one of these. I'm gonna get me a five dollar bill. Um, if you can't roll it, you can um, roll it, um, wrap it around some chapstick, a pencil, or whatever, and roll it up. You can have it for the five dollar to show or not show. Put it in like that, and then you're gonna go ahead and tear the adhesive off. And you're going to go, I'm going to try to line it up. Oops. Okay, whoops. That's totally crooked. Oh, at least you can take it off. Let me set it down. Oops, now my money, my money is rolling everywhere. Okay, and then we're just going to, whoops, my money fell off. Might be good to tape your money in. Yep, now my money's facing the wrong way. Okay, I'm going to hold it. And I put the little eggs as a guide. There we go. Super cute. Super, super cute. So don't press it on and, you know, push it on unless you um, are sure that's the spot. Oh, gorgeous. Let me get my glove and I'll show you guys and then I'll let you guys go. I don't want to keep you. Look at that. Hold on, let me see. Beautiful. And that's black. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, you guys. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.